Greetings, salutations, good morning, and welcome to TV8's Good Morning Vale for Saturday, January 4th, 2020. I almost said 19. That's a live shot from Beaver Creek from our back patio camera. Get nice and zoomed in there. Oh, look at those groomers doing their work, making the incredible corduroy you will find at Vale and Beaver Creek quite apparent throughout the day. I'm one of your hosts for the day, Eric Sundblad, live in our Avon studio. We've got Chris Armistad reporting from the base of Beaver Creek and Michelle Seamer on an epic morning first chair adventure. It's a great day to be out there on the slopes as we've just had about eight to 10 inches of fresh snow uh, over the course of the past week. And you know, your legs might be burning. And when it's time to rest the legs but continue skiing, you're gonna wanna check out one of the five-star groomers available on Vail Mountain. Well, it's five-star grooming. Every bit of their grooming is absolutely impeccable. And they've increased the grooming by 30% this year in the back bowls, the legendary back bowls. So that means they don't have to be afraid of only encountering moguls out in Blue Sky Basin now, you can be assured that there will be plenty of groomed runs for yourself and your family to enjoy. And check out one of their iconic groomers, Blue Ox, one of my personal favorites on high, below Highline Express, that's Chair 10. Uh, you've got Riva Ridge, which is accessed from the top of Mountaintop Express, uh, and you get that as you're headed back down to Vale Village. And then finally, uh, Riva, or rather, Lindsay's, which is on the front face of Vail Mountain as you're headed into Vail Village. And next week, it's a fun week, all week long in Vail, because Oakley is bringing all of their product across the villages of Vail for you to test out. They've got an Oakley Village in Golden Peak where all week long, well, Thursday through Sunday, so starting January 9th, Thursday through Sunday, all week long at the base of Golden Peak, you can demo free Oakley product. You can check out one of their Golden Ticket raffles and win some great prizes. Also at the base of Gondola One and the top of Eagle's Nest, you'll find other areas to demo Oakley products, all starting this Thursday in Vail. And as I said earlier, we've got Chris Armistead at the base of Beaver Creek, ready to interview some fun guests. Thanks, Eric. And you were just talking about all of the five-star grooming, and it's actually quite a bit five-star grooming right under my feet right here at Beaver Creek. I'm really excited to be here. There's not a cloud in the sky behind me. It's going to be one fantastic uh, sunrise up here at Beaver Creek. It's six degrees as we start the day, so you can see my breath. It's definitely brisk, so you're going to want to bundle up if you're heading out for some snowboarding or some skiing today at Beaver Creek or at Vail. Temps will warm up throughout the day. But let's talk a little bit about what Beaver Creek has going on this afternoon. Once you get off the slope, starting at about 4 o'clock, the Beaver Creek Fun Fest is just an amazing uh, event just to my right over here in the Beaver Creek Village. Awesome event for kids. They have tons of stations set up. Kids can run around and grab tokens and play games and collect all these Beaver Creek specific tokens and then turn those in for awesome prizes. There's also some great paleontology events teaching you about the dinosaurs that once roamed here. And uh, another event coming up here at Beaver Creek is uh, tomorrow on January 5th the Beaver Creek Running Series Snowshoe Edition is kicking off up here in Beaver Creek. That event will have some registration down by Beaver Creek Sports, and that begins between 8 and 9.30, and then the race kicks off at about 10 a.m. So if you've never checked that out, if you love snowshoeing, and if you love running, put the two pieces together and get up here and get out there on the 5K or the 10K. There's also all kinds of other great events coming up here in Beaver Creek throughout the month of January. We're all still celebrating that it's all 2020. We have uh, an awesome watch and win coming up later, and it's going to be a Thule travel bag. So if you like Thule gear, it's awesome. It's going to be something you can take with you, and it's just a great thing to travel with. Uh, we're just going to take a quick break, and coming up, I have a weather report for you. Location, location. With more than 40 shops throughout the Rockies, Christie Sports is everywhere you want to ski and ride. Save up to 20% when you reserve your rentals online 24 hours in advance. Christie Sports. We'll see you out there. 
Get ready for a thoroughly captivating experience. Live, on stage, an American in Paris. Wonderful. Based on the 1951 MGM classic, with a score that is pure Gershwin, a story that is pure romance, it's an extravaganza of song and dance. Don't miss An American in Paris. Join us at Vail Public Library and engage your senses weekly with gentle yoga, group meditation, or Zumba as part of our Healthy Lifestyle series. Check out the Tech Studio, our very own makerspace. Explore, create, collaborate, and invent in a safe and supportive environment. Connect with a variety of performers, musicians, authors, historians, as part of our evenings of engagement. We also offer summer reading programs for all ages. We offer a variety of activities for the younger set, including Reading Buddies, a one-on-one -on -one reading experience, Robotics Club, and our Kids Create programs. Vail Public Library is your public library. There's something for everyone, and we hope you'll visit us very soon. Be transported to a European chalet by Snowcat and create your own wonderful memories at Game Creek Restaurant. Enjoy five-star American cuisine and an award-winning wine lust while overlooking Vale's Game Creek Bowl. Vale, like nothing on earth. See you around, little man. Yeah, you'll see me. This Weather and Mountain Report is brought to you by Oakley, the official eyewear, goggle, and helmet sponsor of Vail Resorts. We're looking at a shot from our patio up to Spruce Saddle at Beaver Creek where I'm standing at the base of Centennial right now. Just an amazing shot right there. The sun's just about to peak over the uh, mountain range here and everyone's kind of getting their day started up here at Beaver Creek. We'll, we'll talk to you a bit about the weather here. It's going to start to warm up by 8 a.m. and it's 6 degrees now, but it's going to warm up to 9 degrees at about 8 a.m. with a high of 35 today. So while it's chilly right now, you're going to be able to bundle up and it will warm up quickly while we've had no cloud cover here in the daytime uh, throughout the day today. We also have temps in the mid 30s at all of our resorts uh, all across Beaver Creek, Keystone, and Breckenridge and Vail. So uh, temps should actually feel pretty warm today. Tonight we have a low of 10 degrees and it's gonna be a sunset just before 5 p.m. So should be a beautiful sunset, mostly clear. Today, just tons of sunshine. You're gonna to wanna to put your UV protection on, get an SPF 30 on your face or um, definitely wear a buff to protect against some of the conditions. That five day forecast, you're gonna have a high of 33 tomorrow and then uh, a temp drop into Monday where temps will drop into the teens and then on the way back up it'll be rising into the uh, high 20s and uh, low 30s as you approach Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday with some slight chances of snow coming at the end of that five day forecast. So not a ton in the forecast but we are expecting just a little bit more coming right up. And in just a bit we have Michelle giving us some of the Vail condition reports on her first share. This resort report is brought to you by Good Morning Vale. Follow us on Facebook for live interviews and mountain reports. I am so steady. Conditions are so nice that I am already up on my lift getting off here in Beaver Creek. But we are going to have a great day. Everything looks so nice on the hill, so nicely groomed. But let's talk Vale conditions first. So Vale, 
No new snow in the past uh, overnight, but in the past 48 hours, they have received five inches of some fresh snow with 13 inches in the past seven days. So conditions are spectacular. 130 inches so far for the season with 97% of the mountain open. That's 5,140 acres to go spread out, to go enjoy those back bowls and make some turns. Um, 27 of their 31 lifts are up and running. 184 of their trails are open and they have a 48 inch base. So some great conditions. Now I'm here in Beaver Creek and I gotta say, my ride up the chairlift, the bumps looked fluffy, the grooming looked spectacular. Now, Beaver Creek, same thing, no new snow overnight, but they have had four inches in the past uh, 48 hours and 15 inches in the past seven days with 127 uh, inches so far for the season. They have 1,576 uh, acres ready for riding with 86% of the mountain open, 146 trails with all 23 of their lifts up and running. So the nice part is you can access Beaver Creek now from Avon over by the Westin. You can access Beaver Creek from Arrowhead anywhere you want. So lots of room to spread out. We have lots more Good Morning Vale coming your way. Don't go anywhere. Good Morning Vale is brought to you in part by Helly Hansen, outfitters of Vale Resorts professionals. Visit them in Lion's Head to get outfitted for your day on the mountain. When the mountain tests you, trust is all you have. And trust will set you free. Lion's Head Jewelers, a mainstay of Lion's Head Village for more than a decade, our 4,000 square foot gallery is home to the largest selection of one-of-a-kind designer jewelry in the Vail Valley. Come see our breathtaking array of museum quality fossils, meteorites, and collectible minerals. Explore Lion's Head Jewelers. Spend an afternoon with us. You'll come in as a customer and leave as a friend. There's still plenty of time to get a part-time or full-time position with Vail Resorts and the many benefits to these positions with Vail Resorts. So that includes a free ski pass for yourself and for just a slight additional charge for all of your dependents as well. So if working maybe one, uh, one day a week on the mountain sounds great to you, well now is the time to apply for these positions, including a wonderful opportunity at Beaver Creek Mountain working with their ski valet team. Now this position gets skis ready for guests in the morning, hands the guests the, uh, their skis as they're walking to the lift, and then you get a three hour break to go ski and snowboard before helping the guests out at the end of the day. So that's a great opportunity to not only uh, get to ski throughout your day, you also get that free ski pass and you get to help people have an amazing experience. And we're gonna find out more about working for Vail Resorts right now. Thank you. 
I think the experience of a lifetime is, is for everyone. You know, we want our, our guests to have an experience of a lifetime, but also our employees, we want them to remember what a magical place this is. Uh, this will be my 10th season working for Vail Resorts. I started on uh, mountain safety my first year and then started with patrol nine years ago. I basically have the best job in the world. I mean, I love this job. I've been doing it for 25 years. Uh, I ski <laughs> and I work for a great company. And you know, um, I've been doing what I've been doing since 1989, you know, so I just followed my dream and the passion and just keep doing it day by day. Vail Resorts in North Star gives me the opportunity to live and work in the place I love. I mean, I came out to do one season snowboarding and I fell in love with this place. You know the type of person to work for Vail? I think it's just anybody that is energetic and excited about what they do on a day-to-day -day basis. It just takes a, a special person, but a lot of people are really good at this job. Anybody can do it, and anybody can have a great time. It's all what you make of it. You know, I, I truly believe that my bosses, um, you know, they care about my development and they care about where I want to go in my career, and I think that's really, really, truly unique. For a company to have that dedication and finding people who are looking for the alignment of who they are with where they work, I think helps us build a, a focus in our, our core values and what matters to each of us. And we all share that common passion for what we do and working in the outdoors and working in this industry. And uh, yeah, the, the community here of, of employees is hands down the best thing I've ever experienced. And it's what's kept me coming back for 13 years. And uh, it's gonna keep me around for about another 30 or 40. <laughs> Who wouldn't wanna come work here every day? This is your office, pretty cool. This Weather and Mountain Report is brought to you by Boost Oxygen. Don't let altitude ruin your Rocky Mountain experience. Help is here. We are looking at a shot of Grouse Mountain right at the edge of the Beaver Creek heart of the village here. Just a beautiful shot as that sun is about to rise over the peaks. And here at the edge of Centennial, we are looking at some of the beautiful grooming we have and some of the edge of the Centennial Express as the lifts are starting to get running and people are starting to get their day going. We've got temps that again start at six degrees here and then they're warming up to nine degrees at 8 a.m., moving to a high of 35 today. And tonight's low will be 10 degrees with a sunset just before 5 p.m. So if you're gonna get out, make sure you get out and enjoy that sunset and do it early and do a quicker walk with your dogs because of those chilly temps as you drop down to about 10 degrees tonight. Our resorts are also looking beautiful and just also the I-70 corridor throughout the Eagle County area. We've got uh, temps in the low 30s as a high today in Eagle and in Avon and then moving up to a high of 41 in Vail and Denver's the big winner just below 50 degrees. And again, the temps all throughout the uh, Beaver Creek, Vail and Keystone and Breckenridge resorts are gonna be in the mid 30s throughout the day. Our five day forecast is looking great as we head into uh, Sunday. It's gonna be mostly sunny all throughout the day today. Just tons of snow, uh, sun today and uh, plenty of sun tomorrow. Then the temps will drop to 17 as a high on Monday with a chance of some evening snow uh, tomorrow on Sunday and not as much of a chance on Monday. Then we have uh, temps rising back up to a high of 29 on Tuesday and then up into the low 30s on Wednesday. Thursday, well, Wednesday night and Thursday, chance of a light bit of some snow coming back to us and possibly about one to two inches on those days. Again, we are just having ideal conditions. We've had eight to 10 inches of fresh snowfall in the last five days across our uh, resorts here in the Eagle County area at Vail and Beaver Creek. I was out yesterday, it was outstanding and plenty of great options today. And we have the road report coming up next with Michelle. This road report is brought to you by Good Morning Vail, now also on Colorado's K3 Channel 3 statewide. That is a live look at I-70 eastbound right now. And hopefully you don't have to get on I-70. You can just stay right here in the Vail Valley. And maybe you are just wanting to get off the highway here. It's a great day to be up here. And everything is moving 
pretty smoothly right now, but we do expect that to change throughout the weekend. Um, we're going to see the heaviest traffic eastbound on Sunday, but we're still going to see uh, pretty heavy traffic both directions today. And you know, something to keep in mind, especially on a day like today, where you know it's sunny, you know it, the snow has cleared out of the area for today. Well, on a warmer day like today, you often get that runoff in the afternoon. It heats everything up. You get some water on the roads. And as we move later into the evening, that freezes over and sort of can create some black ice areas, especially in some of the higher elevations. So if you are traveling along the I-70 corridor today, just take your time. Remember that you can hit those little black ice areas and, you know, we actually have. There's no need to go anywhere. You might as well just stay because we have a great watching win. I was looking at this in the studio before I left. There is an awesome tool duffel bag. So don't go anywhere. We've got that coming up in the show as well as we're going to show you a little bit about the legacy of Vail coming up next. When you're here in Colorado, you are at altitude and maybe feeling these signs of altitude sickness. You may feel better by giving yourself a boost. Be prepared for those negative effects of altitude with lightweight and portable bottles of Boost Oxygen. Available in three sizes. Even choose from our aromatherapy options. It's easy to have with you anywhere, even at the summit. We're available at retailers, hotels, and resorts, including these. Host up and tag us. We'll share your adventures. Enjoy your time in the Rocky Mountain region. Give yourself a boost. I'm here with Sarah and Rarity at Beaver Creek and one of my favorite events of the entire year is your Beaver Creek Snowshoe Series and Sarah this is so much fun. It really is. It's a great chance for people to get up and enjoy the fabulous surroundings we have here at Beaver Creek and we have a 5k and a 10k across the three races during the winter season so we have everything from people who are really trying to trim that personal best time at the 10k to people just out to enjoy some exercise and the beauty outdoors and the 5k with the whole family. But you know it's so much more than just the race. It's really an entire experience. It really is. People have the chance to demo snowshoes. So if you're looking for a new pair of snowshoes, it's a great chance to try some out during the race. And then we have our post-race party. So everyone's qualified to win some great raffle prizes. And then we have the meal as well. So it's a full day of fun. Okay, you have to get signed up. Make sure you don't miss out on this incredible chance to get outside, experience Beaver Creek, beavercreek.com slash snowshoe. Don't miss it. The Extraordinary is Ski School at Beaver Creek. It's a learning environment tailored to your child's every need. It's a guarantee that by the third day, children five to six will be skiing Hay Meadow Park, and students seven and older will graduate to Red Buffalo Park, our mountaintop dedicated learning area. The Extraordinary is passing your love of skiing onto your children. Belong in The Extraordinary. Book online for guaranteed best pricing. We're for the fashion forward and budget minded. We've got the brands that set you apart, the style to make you stand out, the looks that let you shine. We're for the dreamers, the doers, and the savers. Outlets at Silverthorne, elevate your savings. Save up to 70% off on over 50 of the best designer brands as you stroll through our three beautiful shopping villages. I think the pioneers of Vail, the, the people that uh, went through the early years and, and made Vail possible, all had you know, the kind of background living in the mountains, skiing, climbing, being a part of the 10th Mountain Division, had adopted a, a point of view that anything was possible, that when problems came along in the early years of Vail, instead of saying, oh God, we can't handle that, we just said, um, We'll do it. There's a way to do it, and went ahead and did it, and got it done, and that's why Vail got built, and uh, that's why it turned out the way it did.
The dream was, as most dreams are, it was a vision uh, of a developed ski mountain with a, a European-style village at the base of the mountain. When we arrived in Vail, nobody was thinking about anything but getting Vail built. We felt that if we did it right, did it properly, it would succeed. I think we all had one dream to make Vail something really special. People took on whatever job was there in front of them. The vital thing that was important then is that they all participated by doing something. I think the success of Vail was the melding together of all the people and allowing them to participate in the growth of Vail. They wanted to create a, a, a ski resort, a really great ski resort, and they wanted to ski every day. <laughs> people loved it. I mean, it was just a, a very special experience to be floating down those slopes in powder. Even if you weren't a good skier, you could find a slope that was gentle enough so you could take a long run before you uh, went for a header. <laughs> There's something for everyone here. Any level, any person, anyone can come here and find something that's for them. There's no place like it on earth. Everybody got here and they were just, they were loose. They were having fun and they were going out on the mountain and having a great time. And then they come down and party at the bottom of the mountain and all of a sudden you have a town. <laughs> and it's all the freedom and it's built out of pure love. It was a lifestyle, a totally undefined lifestyle and you were not judged at all on what you had been, or where you went to school, or whether you had a nickel or a million bucks. None of it mattered. Everybody was evaluated for what kind of a person they were, what kind of a sense of humor they had, and, and uh, it was a given that everybody was there because they loved the mountain. The real deep motivation behind everything was skiing. People that came to Vail really liked to ski, and the skiing was fantastic. It is fantastic. The skiing that I, I was able to do growing up was incredible. I mean, it was such an amazing opportunity, and it's shaped me into the person I am, and, and it's the biggest reason for, for my success in my career. I mean, the mountain is the mountain. The mountain is, is, is it's better today um, than it ever was. The joy of skiing never goes away. It hasn't gone away now either. It's still there. I mean, you, it's just exciting, you know, harnessing gravity, flying down the mountain. You know, you strap a couple of boards on your feet and head down and you get going. And the faster you go, the easier it is to turn, mostly, until you get too fast. Yeah, no, it's a wonderful experience. That hasn't changed a bit. That's why Vail is still successful. No matter what happens, you can't take that experience away. This Weather and Mountain Report is brought to you by GMC, the exclusive partner of Vail Resorts. A lot of times in the winter, the cooler the early mornings are, the warmer and more comfortable the midday is going to be. And this Saturday represents exactly that as we had very low cloud cover overnight. So that caused any of the heat built up over yesterday to dissipate into the upper atmosphere. And that's leaving us with a fairly chilly morning this Saturday, starting off around nine degrees at the base of Vail at 8 a.m. Temperatures will climb, like I said, to a very comfortable 35 degrees, abundant sunshine throughout the course of the day. And moving into the evening hours, uh, expect some cloud cover potentially to begin to later on tomorrow morning, but for the most part, clear morning tomorrow. Again, similar temperatures today, around 10 degrees to start the day off. I wanted to bring up the moisture radar map here for you, and we can see a very fast moving storm beginning to develop over Colorado. That's that blue strip uh, from north to south, kind of grazing its way across Colorado. And that should be into effect starting on Sunday. Uh, as we look at the five day forecast, we are expecting a little bit of snow to grace us tomorrow, potentially in the evening hours, but it will be a very fast moving storm. So by the time we get to Tuesday, skies are clear again. Uh, however, along the Pacific, 
we are tracking a storm system that can hopefully arrive by late next week to bring us additional snow. Thanks to GMC for sponsoring this weather. Now we're going to give you your Super Goop UV forecast. This UV forecast is brought to you by Super Goop, the official sunscreen of Vail Resorts. All right, just a big thank you to Super Goop. They are the best sunblock and sun protection under the sun. That's our UV forecast, and it's a uh, low of two degrees today, so you're gonna wanna make sure to get an SPF of 30 plus on your skin. Just that added protection, a uh, uh, layer protection will always help you in uh, these lower single digit temperatures. Again, it's a low of two. And uh, again, thank you to Super Goop for being the best sunblock out there. I always put that on before I go hit the mountain. You're going to want to do the same. If you don't have it, go find it at one of the local stores. We have Eric coming up just in a, a quick minute here, and he is with the gear experts from Double Diamond, giving you everything you need for your skiing and riding experiences. Only the best. Lion's Head Jewelry Fossil and Mineral Gallery, voted top 50 designer jewelry retailer in the country by JCK in 2009. Featuring the largest collection of fine, designer, traditional, and contemporary jewelry. Lion's Head Jewelers, the most unique collection of decorative art in the Vale Valley. Lion's Head Jewelers, museum quality collection of fossils, minerals, and meteorites dated 40 to 500 million years old. Lion's Head Jewelers, located in Lion's Head on the corner of the ice skating rink. See you around, little man. Yeah, you'll see me. Let us put you in the spirits. Hey guys, I'm looking for some amazing craft beer. We got it! Hi, I'm looking for the best wine selection in the Vale Valley. That's us! I'm looking for great customer service and an awesome rewards program. They got it. So if you want great customer service and amazing shopping experience, and we'll even hop in the truck and deliver your goods, then stick with the local's favorite. Come on down to Avon Liquor. And let us put you in the spirits. As the region's most preferred orthopedic practice, we specialize in keeping you active and getting you back to the things you love. The physicians at Vail Summit Orthopedics will take care of all your orthopedic needs from head to toe. Get ready for a thoroughly captivating experience. Live, on stage, an American in Paris. Wonderful, Based on the 1951 MGM classic, with a score that is pure Gershwin, a story that is pure romance. It's an extravaganza of song and dance. Don't miss an American in Paris. Well, Double Diamond Ski Shop in Lion's Head is truly the ski shop that has everything. And if you don't believe me, look at this smorgasbord of yeah. gear, all extremely crucial to maximize your fun on the mountain. Bryant Richards from yeah. Double Diamond, thanks for joining us. Yeah, good morning. Yeah, good morning. You know, we always ask, I always get asked a lot of questions like, uh, you guys always carry the best gear, and uh, what is it? What's the best pair of goggles? And I want to bring out a pair that I really, really like. Uh, this is from Juro. This is the contact goggle and probably my favorite goggle because it's super easy to replace the lens. It literally comes off with one press of the button up here on the top and this lens goes right back on. It also comes with two lenses. So it uses a Carl Zeiss lens. A lot of people might be familiar with that lens. They use them a lot in uh, uh, cameras, but yep. in the goggles, it, you know, it really helps take out a lot of the UV light and really helps enhance a lot of the clarity. So it does come with that extra lens and that really cool case. You can throw it in your, in your jacket inside, not a lot of bulk, uh, but really easy to switch out. You get a low light and a full sunny day lens for those super sunny days. Yeah, if you're not buying a goggle with an easy lens change system, yeah. multiple lenses these days, you're doing something Absolutely, wrong. and over the years, you know, we've gotten really good at switching out the lenses, but you want the, the easiest the lens switch, the, the magnet, this thing is the way to go. All right, what's up next, buddy? Yeah, next up, uh, I also want to bring out the Armada Tracer, and this ski's been in their line for two years, except this is a little bit wider one. This is a 108 underfoot, and they actually use a uh, Karuba wood, so it's a, a lot lighter wood, 
a little less dense, um, but this thing is super light. For not having any metal in the ski, um, it skis exceptionally well. And obviously as much snow as we've been getting in the last few days, if you've been venturing into the Back Bowls or Grouse Mountain, you definitely want to have a ski that's a little bit wider underfoot, and that thing can definitely handle anything that gets thrown at it. Um, 108, you know, is kind of more towards that bigger mountain powder ski, so mm -hmm. I obviously have its little brother, the Tracer 98, uh, if you didn't want to go so wide. Yeah. Also brought out face masks for the kids. Southwest Saturday print. I love the back strap. <laughs> these guys are awesome. Um, we actually keep all these cardboard uh, pieces. Uh, it's zero waste. So we actually send them back to the company and uh, they actually give some of the money back towards the artists to help them keep coming up with really cool prints. These are four way stretch, windproof, and water can adhere to this. So if you're still using your cotton bandana and you're wondering why your face is still getting cold, you have to switch to one of these. These things really, really work really good and they come with a lot of fun prints for the kids. Yeah, they do. It's the only face mask I've ever had that hasn't frozen on me. Exactly. And Great. you know, that's just because the water molecules can adhere to it. And speaking of uh, water molecules, you know, a lot of our uh, jackets that we carry in the store, we just started carrying our Terex. It's a new brand for us this year. They're based out of Canada. A lot of people are familiar with the, uh, the logo on there. That's actually one of the oldest bird fossils that was uh, found completely together. They've been making some of the best technical outerwear and have been using Gore-Tex in their jackets since 1996. Um, I really like this Sabre jacket that we pulled out. Fully seam sealed zippers all the way around. It is Gore-Tex, so meaning water vapor can escape through the jacket. But if you're out in the cold and the snow, water cannot come through. Mm -hmm. So uh, really breathable. Also brought out the Atom jacket. I love this piece. This is our number one selling jacket from them for the last few years. Um, extremely lightweight. It uses a core loft insulation and uh, has two different variances. So it has a thick, little bit thicker and thinner insulation. So it really helps keep the loft of the jacket and insulate uh, and continue to insulate. Also brought in some of the pants. I love the pants because they're insulated. A lot of people go back and forth between do we want an insulated pant or a shell pant. I do like the insulated pants and you can uh, wear a lighter kind of first layer with it as well. Helps out early mornings on the chairlift. Absolutely. For sure. And then if everybody's looking for a favorite sock, we just got these in. These are the new Cody Townsend sock. And the really cool thing about this, these guys are from Labent. They use a bamboo and merino wool, but they put silicone on the top of this sock. I know it's kind of hard to see, but it actually makes it so the sock can't slip down. Innovation of the year. Yeah, right. innovation of the year. I, I mean, really, like, like everybody's that. been asking for this. Like, how do you make a sock not slip down yeah. if you're touring? Um, it has a special zone on the top of the foot, so the way that it's sewn, it really helps lock your heel down. Really comfortable, easy to get on. And with the Merino, it helps keep the stink down. You don't have to wash these as much. Really, really comfortable and easy to get on. All right, thank yeah. you very much, Bryant. This is a heck of a spread, and you can find all of this and more at Double Diamond Ski Shop, located in Lion's Head Vale, uh, just on your left as you're walking from the parking structure to the Eagle Bond gondola. Stop on in and say hi. Test out one of these Armada Tracer skis. Start your day off right at Double Diamond. This weather report is brought to you by the outlets at Silverthorne. Three villages, hundreds of brands, one great Rocky Mountain location. You know, it just looks like someone took a paintbrush and just painted all around Durkham Mountain there. Definitely giving Colorado its nickname, Colorful Colorado, this morning with all those beautiful colors in the sky. And it is just going to be such a beautiful day outside today. So much sunshine. It's beautiful across the state today. And it's just going to be a wonderful time to get outside and enjoy some of this great weather. Starting off around 9 degrees, but again, that sun is out warming things up. We're going to warm up to the mid-30s today, and as we go through the week, tomorrow it's going to be another beautiful day in the low 30s, high around 33. There is a chance of some evening snow coming in tomorrow, around a 50% chance, but overall it should be a great day. Our world is constantly changing, but the joys of winter are eternal. This fall, celebrate the official kickoff to winter with Warren Miller's 70th anniversary film, Timeless, presented by Volkswagen. Explore British Columbia, Colorado, France, Austria, Switzerland, and more, alongside legendary ski icons like Glenn Flake. It's not just a movie, it's an experience 70 years in the making. Find a show near you at warrenmiller.com.
Nest Furnishings and Consignment, located in the heart of the Vale Valley. Nest offers a variety of beautiful, affordably priced home furnishings, art, and accessories for your mountain home. Henredon Restoration Hardware, Ralph Lauren, just to name a few brands available at Nest. Decorate your mountain home at Nest Furnishings and Consignment. Consignment redefined. Vail's most talented architects, builders, and interior design firms are creating some of the most spectacular homes in America. And our cameras will take you inside these homes and introduce you to Vail's most respected real estate companies specializing in high-end properties. Watch the Vail Home Show each day right here on Vail's TV8 or online. And remember, you can catch this show on the web anytime at valehomeshow.com. Welcome back to Beaver Creek. I'm standing here with Laura Jodish from the White Carpet Club at Beaver Creek. Laura, thank you for being here. Thank you. Yes, so we were just talking and you were out early yesterday on First Tracks. I was, yeah, it That's was awesome. such a great experience. It's an awesome experience. We have a eight for the season reserve First Tracks and they're open to the public and it includes a full breakfast. You're the first people on the mountain. We've got all kinds of terrain available. And uh, yesterday we had like an inch or two on top of the fresh groom stuff. Oh, uh, that's yeah. awesome. So all those people, they got to experience just that great fresh snowfall mm -hmm. before anyone else was out there. Yeah. And then over to Allie's cabin for a delicious breakfast, right? Yeah, yeah it was awesome. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> so we should talk a little bit more about just all the other great programs you have. It's mm -hmm. not just the membership only. You have stuff like Ski Valet right over here at the edge of Centennial, and that's open to the public on a daily rate. Right, so um, our White Carpet Club is, its we call it a club, but you don't have to be a member. It's similar to like a, um, a passport club or a club you see at the airport, where um, if you're here on your ski vacation, um, come on in and we've got a lounge, um, it's comfortable, it's convenient, it's right in the heart of the village, and then we do have Slopeside uh, Ski Valley. Right, so yeah. as we were talking about before we were on camera, it was just your location is down by the Coyote Cafe here in the Beaver Creek Village. Right, so our lounge is uh, two escalators away from the slopes, which is super convenient. So even if you're staying at a ski in ski out property or down in Avon, or Edwards, something like that, it includes parking, you can come on up, um, parking lot is, or our parking garage is right next to the White Carpet Club. And then we've got places for you to store your boots at night. So you can come here in your street shoes and be comfortable. Oh, that's great. So mm -hmm. I love the idea of if you're in Avon, especially, mm -hmm. you don't yeah. always have to take all that gear with you. You know, right. you could leave it here as you know you're coming right back the next day. Right, and it's super convenient for families, um, especially if you're in ski school, you can come on in with your kids, get them ready get them off to ski school, it's again, one escalator away, drop them off, and then come back to the club, get yourselves ready, and then go up and enjoy the mountain. I'm a dad yeah. of three, <laughs> and it is mind-blowing yeah. how much gear you have to load up oh, if right. you're the dad. That's right. I call it kind of dad Sherpa sometimes. Right. <laughs> the helmets, the skis, the poles, everything. So, um, and if you're not a family, you're a couple, you're here with some friends, that sort of thing, we've got different packages. We've, we've got uh, memberships for all sizes of groups. So com come in and or call us and we'd be more than happy to walk through the, the process with you. And you said the next first tracks also is just a couple weeks away, so nothing in the you know foreseeable, you right. know, quick week future, but coming up mm -hmm. it's soon. Right, we have, um, like I mentioned, we have eight first tracks specifically uh, as part of the reserve program, and our next one is January 19th. It's over MLK weekend, oh, okay. so it's a Sunday, Sunday morning experience, and then we've got another one the following Sunday with our culinary uh, weekend as well. Oh, that's yeah. great. That's coming up. What a great event here yeah. at Beaver Creek. Yep. And MLK weekend is a busy weekend, so that's great yeah. that you have all these value-added options mm -hmm. for people. Yep. And there's also plenty coming up in the next few days here. We've got that right. snowshoe race here tomorrow. Mm -hmm. We've got all those wine and cheese excursions you mentioned. <laughs> right. We've got a... Um, We've got a fun program out of our Nordic Center, which is the wine excursions. There happens three days a week. We do a full snowshoe tour um, up at McCoy Park, and then we end it with a wine and cheese pairing over at the Osprey. And it's a really nice, unique experience for our for our maybe non-skiing guests, or if you're taking a break from skiing, um, it's an awesome option. And that's at the Fireside Grill at the Osprey. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. that it sounds so yeah. <laughs> good. I love yeah. anything like that, a charcuterie plate. Just, yeah. oh, what a great way to end your day. 
And then um, coming up this week too, um, on the mountain, we have our mountain welcome tours that will be in full force. Those are at 10 o'clock. If you're just new to the area or want to be a little bit more familiar with the train, our mountain welcome tours are at 10 o'clock at the top of Centennial Lift. Okay. And then if you're a female and um, you want to be part of a women's kind of social program, our tours start on Tuesday, Tuesday morning at 10 o'clock as well. Oh, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. Well, that's great info. We yeah. have to wrap up here, but Laura, yeah. thank you for being here. And we're coming up next with a weather report. Elevate your adventure this winter at Winter on the Mountain at Glenwood Caverns Adventure Park in Glenwood Springs. It's a dazzling array of holiday lights and family activities. From thrill rides to cave tours to amazing views, it's the West Slope's most unique adventure. Only $37 for kids and $42 for adults. For unlimited rides, cave tours, and attractions. For hours and to learn more, go to glenwoodcaverns.com. Glenwood Caverns Adventure Park. It's awesome! Here at PSI, we've been serving the Valley's plumbing, heating, and drain cleaning needs for over 18 years. We are expert technicians with the knowledge and training to provide prompt and professional maintenance and repair. Our fleet of vehicles are equipped with the most advanced technology and tools available today. PSI is committed to providing the best possible service and guarantee our work. Call us anytime, day or night. PSI is here for you 24-7, 365. We look forward to hearing from you. This weather and mountain report is brought to you by Beaver Creek Resort. It is going to be an absolutely gorgeous Saturday to get out and enjoy Beaver Creek Mountain and maybe check out Elkhorn Lift, which is the chairlift in the foreground. There's some really great pine trees around the Elkhorn Lift area to enjoy plenty of the fresh powder that we have gotten over the course of the past seven days. So much great snow up on Vale and Beaver Creek Mountains. Well, let's take a look at your daily temperature for this Saturday to see how you can get best prepared to enjoy your day. Well, starting things off, it's going to be a little chilly, 9 degrees uh, at 8 a.m. at the base of Vale, getting as high as 35 degrees, though. So maybe some variable layering, uh, maybe a down insulator underneath a shell that you can remove and store somewhere throughout the course of the day will keep you most comfortable. It should be about 10 degrees. Uh, this evening as the sun sets right around the 4.50, 4.45 p.m. time frame. Uh, now looking at the conditions across our four favorite I-70 corridor resorts, all very similar conditions right in the mid to upper 30s. And look at that snow count over the past five days, 12 inches across Vail, Beaver Creek, and Breckenridge, and 10 inches at Keystone. So much great snow this past week. Now looking at the five day forecast, we can expect a little bit more snow on Sunday evening. There's a very fast moving storm that should drop a, maybe one to three inches uh, across our valley. And a little bit of patience through Monday and Tuesday. And by the time we get to late week, another storm that could potentially bring with it four to eight inches should be arriving. Right now, it's, it's a little unknown if it will hit the northern mountains or southern mountains of Colorado or right here in Vail in the central mountains. We'll see, fingers crossed. Thanks to Beaver Creek Resort Company for sponsoring this weather. Now we're gonna see what Michelle Seamer is up to on her first chair adventure. First chair is brought to you by Sun and Ski Sports, your new mountain sports headquarters. Conditions are just gonna be spectacular today. So Beaver Creek has had 15 inches in the last seven days and right now I'm up here um, sort of midway to the top at the top of chair six centennial express and the corduroy I'm on feels really soft the sun is out 
no wind, nothing. Absolutely beautiful day, great light for getting out on the hill. The big thing to think about if you're headed out on the hill today is there's gonna be a pretty big difference in temperature starting out the day to the afternoon. We're gonna warm up by about 25 degrees. So even though it might be starting out a little bit chilly, as soon as you start moving, as soon as you're out on the hill enjoying yourself, that sun's gonna be out, it's gonna feel a lot warmer. So if you're coming out a little bit later in the afternoon, maybe take a layer off or have a layer that you can peel off throughout the day, but it's going to be a great time for that. Now, we've had quite a difference in the weather over the last couple of days. In the next week, it's going to go from sunny to cooler to, you know, different light conditions. So it's a great time to start thinking about tuning those skis. You've probably been out riding for these two weeks that everyone's been out of school, taking a little vacation from work. So drop your skis off over at Sun and Ski, get them all nice and tuned up so you're ready for that next big break. Now, something else coming up in the show that you're not going to want to miss is we have that Thule duffel bag still waiting to give away to that lucky person. Don't go anymore. Lots more Good Morning Vale. Holiday season, give your family the gift of the extraordinary. This resort report is brought to you by Good Morning Vale. Follow us on Facebook for live interviews and mountain reports. Beaver Creek is well known for bringing in plenty of amazing events throughout the course of the winter to keep you entertained. And starting January 23rd, running through January 26th is Beaver Creek Winter Culinary Weekend. This is a weekend full of famous celebrity chefs, full of delightful food and fun outdoor activities blended with food, like a snowshoe around McCoy Park, followed by an elegant dining experience, all part of Beaver Creek's Winter Culinary Weekend. It is not a weekend that you want to miss. Uh, the snowshoe excursions are absolutely incredible. Uh, they lead to a small cabin uh, that is very intimate dining experience. And this year they've got celebrity chef Antonia Lofaro, Lafar, Lafar, Lafaso, apologies Antonia if you're watching. Uh, she is well renowned for being on Top Chef on Bravo, uh, for having many various restaurants uh, across the country and it's, she's gonna bring in some unique food. Uh, it's gonna be an incredible experience and that's January 23rd through the 26th for Beaver Creek's Winter Culinary Weekend. It's certainly an event you don't want to miss throughout the course of each year as it continues to return. And now we're gonna check out a little bit more information about the Winter Culinary Weekend.
When the mountain tests you, trust is all you have. And trust will set you free. Hi, I'm Dan Tallene, owner of Carrots Jewelers, located on East Meadow Drive in Vail Village. I've been a custom jeweler in Vail for more than 38 years. At Carrots, our passion is designing exclusive custom jewelry that features one-of-a-kind designs. Stop in and visit Carrots, a working studio gallery of fine art jewelry. To learn more about our custom designs, call 970-476-4760 or visit our website, CarrotsVail.com. See you around, little man. Yeah, you'll see me. As the region's most preferred orthopedic practice, we specialize in keeping you active and getting you back to the things you love. The physicians at Vail Summit Orthopedics will take care of all your orthopedic needs from head to toe. This weather and mountain report is brought to you by GMC, the exclusive partner of Vail Resorts. Welcome back to the base of Beaver Creek here at the base of Centennial Chairlift and I just want to say thank you to GMC, our sponsor for the weather and one of our long running sponsors. So again, thank you to GMC for always looking out for us. We have temps here at the base of Centennial that started right now at six degrees and it's going to warm up to nine degrees at 8 a.m. And then we're moving to a high of 35 today. So again, single digits to start it does feel brisk. I can see my breath, but it's going to warm up fast. But you will want to protect that face, protect those uh, extremities and just make sure you're bundled up and warm today. Tonight we have a, a low of 10 degrees and a sunset just before 5 p.m. and all across Eagle County it's going to be a beautiful mostly sunny day. Highs uh, in the low 30s in Eagle and Avon and Vail will creep up into the low 40s. Denver's that big temp winter currently for Saturday with uh, temps just below 50 degrees. So again Barely a cloud in the sky up here. It's just gorgeous. Uh, we're seeing a lot of racers getting out here today. It's going to be a great morning race uh, type temperature for going fast out there. Our forecast at all of the uh, resorts, it's uh, mid 30s at Breck and Keystone and uh, low 30s in Vail and Beaver Creek. Again, 8 to 10 inches throughout the last five days. Great powder out there. And let's just look at our five day forecast. We will have temps again staying in the low 30s tomorrow, uh, mostly sunny, partly cloudy, and then temps will drop on Monday into the teens with a high of 17. So again, it will get chilly again by the start of the week. And then moving back up into the high 20s and uh, creeping up into the low 30s by Wednesday and Thursday with a chance of snow in the evening on Wednesday. We have a ton more in our second hour of Good Morning Vale coming up. I'll be interviewing Hans Herner. We've got a watch and win. It's a great watch and win giveaway today. It's a Thule duffel bag, 90 liter duffel bag. So you're going to really want to pay attention and make sure you get that question right. Call in, be our winner of this awesome Thule bag. And again, just coming up, tons more in our second hour of Good Morning Vale.
Good morning, friends, and welcome to the second hour of TVH Good Morning Vale for Saturday, January 4th, 2020. That is Centennial Lift at the base of Beaver Creek Mountain. Thanks to Baker, our remote camera operator, for getting us that lovely shot this morning. And I'm one of your hosts today, Eric Sundblad, live in our Avon studio. We've got Chris Armistad reporting live from the base of Beaver Creek and Michelle Seamer at the top of Beaver Creek, showing off some incredible early morning conditions as part of First Chair. And speaking of incredible conditions, while well, both Vale and Beaver Creek have received 12 inches of snow over the past five days. So much snow, so much amazing powder in the trees and all over the mountains. If it's time to give those legs a break or maybe you're just starting things off where well, you're going to want to head over to Vail, check out their amazing five-star grooming experience. Five-star grooming includes 30% more grooming in the back bowls of Vail, so you don't need to be intimidated about going to Blue Sky Basin because you can be assured that there are some fun, mellow groomers all over Blue Sky Basin now. And check out one of Vail's iconic signature groomers, Blue Ox, located off of Highline Express Chairlift number 10, Reva Ridge, which can be accessed from the top of Mountaintop Express Chair number four, and finally Lindsay's, which is most easily accessed from either Chair two, uh, Avanti Express, or Chair four, Mountaintop Express. That leads you right down into Vail Village. Lindsay's is an amazing run. And coming up this week in Vail is Oakley Week, starting Thursday, January 9th. Oakley Eyewear will be bringing their signature prism lenses for free demos across the base of Golden Peak, uh, where their Oakley Village will be happening Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And Friday at 2 p.m. at the base of Golden Peak, demo some prism goggles and be ready to ride with your favorite Oakley athletes. And you'll also get a free drink coupon Friday at 2 p.m. for riding along with the Oakley athletes. And then at Larkspur at the base of Golden Peak on Friday and Saturday at 2 p.m., Oakley will be having a wonderful little apre party where you can check out all of their fabulous prism lenses. And Michelle Seamer is currently at the top of Beaver Creek Mountain giving us some gorgeous views this morning. I love getting to come out to Beaver Creek and do these first chairs and share all these conditions with you and all the fun events that they have going on at the mountains. And, you know, something I wanted to tell everyone about, you know, maybe your New Year's resolution was to get in shape or work out a little bit more. Well, it doesn't have to mean joining a gym or anything boring like that, because tomorrow kicks off the Beaver Creek Snowshoe Race Series. Now, don't let the word race series intimidate you because they have everything from just a mellow 5k to a 10k and everything from you know your first time snowshoers to your elite athletes so it's a lot of fun for everyone all ages and it's an easy way to start getting yourself in shape now prices start at just $30 for this event. Registration is at 8.30 to 9.30 um, next to Beaver Creek Sports. The event uh, starts off at 10 a.m. at Creekside Park, so it's nice, a little bit lower of an elevation, you know, if you're just starting out with snowshoeing to test out and see how you like it. And it's followed up afterwards with a raffle that all the athletes are put into. You get yourself a nice meal after you've earned all of it from that nice workout. And it's just a lot of fun, a lot of camaraderie. So definitely a fun thing to check out if you have never been snowing, shoeing before. It's a great way to do it. And, you know, maybe you need a nice uh, backpack to take all your stuff back home in and a nice duffel. Well, we have this cool Thule duffel bag watch and win coming up in the second hour. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with more Good Morning Vale. Here at PSI, we've been serving the Valley's plumbing, heating, and drain cleaning needs for over 18 years. We are expert technicians with the knowledge and training to provide prompt and professional maintenance and repair. Our fleet of vehicles are equipped with the most advanced technology and tools available today. PSI is committed to providing the best possible service and guarantee our work. Call us anytime, day or night. PSI is here for you 24-7, 365. We look forward to hearing from you.
right here in the heart of Avon, you're going to find Beaver Liquors. You're going to find the proprietor, David Courtney. Uh, David, Beaver Liquors has been here for over four decades. Is that correct? Yeah, 42 years to be exact. It's the oldest business in Avon, actually. Is no it one's, really? No one's ever lasted this long. You guys have something for everybody, something to tease and entice their palate, whether it's wine, lots of whiskeys. Tell us what it is that you do here and all your offerings. So, uh, you know, obviously everybody out there knows that tequilas and bourbons have become this huge thing that people are chasing. So last spring we uh, did our, made our selection much larger. We increased our tequilas by 70 and our bourbons by about 80. And then we, yep, we incorporate that with our wine cellar, which is right below us here. It's just, uh, it's 3,000 square feet. It's 15 feet underground. So it stays naturally cool. Even in August here, even though it doesn't get very warm, it's about 57 degrees downstairs. So your Beaver Liquors is packed to the gills with everything. How did you find room for 80 more bottles of whiskey? We, we bought more shelves. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey, so one of the other things you guys do here big with your business is your delivery. Tell us about it. Yeah, so we uh, we do a huge business with our delivery. You can go to the website, which is beaverlickers.com, or you can just call us, 970-949-5040. And uh, we deliver twice a day, Monday through Saturday, at 2 p.m. and at 8 p.m. It's a $100 minimum, otherwise it's a $10 charge, but we all know when you're on a ski vacation, $100 is nothing. That's basically a bottle of tequila and then some. Right. And you're going to get a couple of those for sure. And what's your reach around the valley? So we uh, we deliver valley-wide. You call us, we'll be there. So, uh, you know, all we need is just a little bit of notice. We leave the store at 2 and we leave the store at 8, so we can accommodate you. Love it. David, thanks for your time. Thank you. Beaverlickers.com, right here in the heart of Avon. We're for the fashion forward and budget minded. We've got the brands that set you apart, the style to make you stand out, the looks that let you shine. We're for the dreamers, the doers, and the savers. Outlets at Silverthorne, elevate your savings. Save up to 70% off on over 50 of the best designer brands as you stroll through our three beautiful shopping villages. This weather report is brought to you by Christie Sports Ski and Snowboard Shops. We'll see you out there. Good morning to you as well, Lion Said. I love Lion Said Village. Uh, it gives you access to Game Creek Bowl, uh, quick access to Avanti Express, home of some of the most incredible steeper groomers around Vail. Start your day off in Lion Said. It is an amazing village. Uh, and looking at the temperatures for your Saturday, things are starting off a little chilly today. Nine degrees at 8 a.m. because we didn't have any cloud cover to keep us insulated last uh, overnight. So things are a little chilly this morning. However, we will receive a high of 35 degrees throughout the course of the day. Uh, this evening, as the sun slowly sets, we should see things drop to about 10 degrees as your overnight low. So similar conditions to what we're experiencing today. And now popping out to the national map here, uh, we do have this little high pressure ridge suppressing moisture for today, but we are having, to, and it's not visible here, but there are little bitty storm systems building around Utah, quickly swinging through the jet stream moving fairly fast right now. Uh, this Pacific storm up here is the one to focus on for later this week. Here we've got the jet stream making a little bit of a north to south after moving uh, easterly into the Idaho range. And that would be ideal for that storm system in the Pacific to just drop its way right into Colorado. And then looking at the five day forecast now uh, on Sunday tomorrow, that's where those quick storms that we weren't necessarily visible on the national map should be moving through. And then the storms in the Pacific, those are represented on Wednesday and Thursday, currently a 20% chance of those storms arriving. If they do, it could bring us an additional eight plus inches of snow. But right now we're just at about 20% chance of that occurring. So it's going to take a little bit of weather luck in the upper atmosphere to bring us those Pacific storms, but fairly consistent temperatures for the remainder of the week. Thanks to Christie Sports for sponsoring this weather. Now we're going to catch up with Michelle Seamer again on First Chair. First Chair is brought to you by Vail Summit Orthopedics and Neurosurgery, keeping you active. 
Hey, so I wanted to tell you a little bit about the Epic Mix app. And hopefully by now you're familiar with it. You know all the cool things it can do. You know how you can track your photos. But I want to tell you a little bit of a story and I want to tell you a little bit about safety because something that a lot of people don't realize about this app is there's a little red cross in the top right corner whenever you have it open. And this will link you directly to Ski Patrol. So, and I'm a mom, you know, I've got kids, they go out on the hill. And whether your kid is doing a run with you, maybe to get lost, they can't find you, or, you know, things happen and you need ski patrol in the days gone by. It used to take someone skiing down to the base, hopefully you were skiing with a friend, and you would tell the lifty, you know, hey, my friend fell down, we need ski patrol, and then you'd have to wait. Well, now, if you have your phone on you and you have the Epic Mix app, you can press that little button, whether it's for yourself or for someone in your party, it's gonna link you directly to Ski Patrol. They're gonna be able to help you whether you're a child who just can't find mom and dad, you got lost on the hill, or you're someone who needs medical assistance. It's gonna put you in direct contact with them, reducing the amount of time that you're waiting on the hill for that help that you need. Now, my husband, when he used it, linked him directly to Ski Patrol, took him to the Vail Valley Hospital, and they actually called directly Vail Summit Orthopedic and Neurosurgery, who came and met him directly at the hospital to just fix everything up right there. So check it out, it's all on the Epic Mix app. But coming up next, we're gonna be checking out some of the gear to get you on the hill with Christy Sports. At Christie Sports, we've got your back. With expert teams in more than 40 locations, we've got the right knowledge and rental gear for your skiing and boarding adventures. Reserve your gear online now. Christie Sports, we'll see you out there. Hey guys, I'm looking for some amazing craft beer. We got it! Hi, I'm looking for the best wine selection in the Vail Valley. That's us! I'm looking for great customer service and an awesome rewards program. They got it! So if you want great customer service and amazing shopping experience, and we'll even hop in the truck and deliver your goods, then stick with the locals' favorite. Come on down to Avon Liquor. And let us put you in the spirits! See you around, little man. Yeah, you'll see me. Elevate your adventure this winter at Winter on the Mountain at Glenwood Caverns Adventure Park in Glenwood Springs. It's a dazzling array of holiday lights and family activities. From thrill rides to cave tours to amazing views, it's the West Slope's most unique adventure. Only $37 for kids and $42 for adults. For unlimited rides, cave tours, and attractions. For hours and to learn more, go to glenwoodcaverns.com. Glenwood Caverns Adventure Park. It's awesome! Welcome back. We're at the base of Centennial here in the heart of Beaver Creek. I'm with Hans from Christie Sports. Hans, thanks for being here. Always. So Saturday you brought morning. Saturday mornings. You brought us some headgear, right? Yeah, for sure. Brought out some headgear this morning. And As of course, I, DFP. DFP too. As I look behind me, it's bringing back memories. The good old race days. Yeah, tons of little racers behind us getting ready to rip and shred today. Go little, fast. Little rippers. Hey, watch out next year. My little Hans Jr. is going to be here. Yeah, can like, he start at one, one and a half, maybe two? Of course he can. Yeah. And he can smoke all these little kids. Right, just show him some GS turns. Yeah, he'll be in his headgear. You know? Awesome. All right, so let's get into it. So I brought the most crucial thing to ski in today. Ski boots, Christie Sports, 100% known for custom boot fitting. This morning I brought the head, 
light 110. This boot's gonna be super lightweight, but 100% custom moldable for your foot. We actually can heat up the shell and the liner and pretty much vacuum seal it to your foot so you're gonna get a very accurate performing boot fit. And that's a 110 flex, right? 110 flex. Cool thing with this too, if you see here, liquid fit. What we actually do is we inject this with a paraffin material so it's actually gonna pretty much seal around your foot. Everyone's feet are different, right and left, and we wanna make sure that you have a very precise boot fit so you can go tear up the mountain. Another thing with boot fit we always recommend is a 100% custom moldable footbed. What we do is heat this up and then we actually shape it to the boot. So when you walk out of any Christie Sports, you're going to have a 100% custom boot fit for your feet. That's awesome. And that paraffin's like a gel mold, essentially. Exactly. And what's cool, it actually never hardens. So, you know, skiing's a back and forward motion sport. So that gel material is actually going to be flex and come back and respond. Exactly. It's awesome. me for like a memory foam bed or something like exactly that. Exactly what it is. Awesome. So Christie Sports, custom boot fitting. Come see us. We'll yeah, you can't go in. wrong with that custom insole. Never. What a major difference that makes. All right, let's jump into the skis. Yeah, let's jump into the skis back here. All right. Start with the women's total joy. You know, conditions today are going to be a little bit more on the firm side. We've had almost two feet of fresh snow in the last week. So today is going to be definitely a good groomer day. So I brought a couple of our great groomer slash all mountain skis. This is the women's total joy. It's going to be super forgiving, has a nice side cut, so it's going to be quick edge to edge. And for the ladies, the ski, you're going to be happy wherever you are on the mountain. That's awesome. For sure. And then I brought kind of the mate, the head total joy, or sorry, the Titan. So this ski's been around for about five years, and let me tell you, this is one ripping ski. I saw more of these than any ski on the wall. What's super cool about the Head Titan is they have a patent material called graphene. So it's going to be a super lightweight, durable atom material. Yet still stiff and responsive. Exactly. Always stiff and responsive, you know. And what's cool about this ski too is they have another patent called KERS. What that is is it's kinetic energy release system. It's actually a microchip built into the ski. What's going to do is it's going to store energy and as you release through the turn, you're going to be zipping. This thing is a rocket ship. That's awesome. I love that. So you also could talk about uh, your, your store location here in the heart of the Beaver Creek Village. You have one down in Avon, one in Westvale. For sure. So in the Vale Valley, like you said, up here in Beaver Creek, right by the main bus stop, down in the heart of Avon, Westvale, and then top of Bridge Street in Vale. And then, you know, we're Colorado, Utah, New Mexico, Pacific Northwest. We have close to 80 stores now, and we're here to suit your new skiing and snowboarding needs. And tons of great deals online as well. Always. We do have an online store, christysports.com. Also, you can book your rentals, save 20%. And Christy Sports, we're here to help you. Awesome. Well, Hans, thanks for being here. Thanks for always bringing the gear. And we are coming up with a weather report from Michelle. This weather report is brought to you by the Eagle County Regional Airport. Get flight information at flyvale.com. I'm just taking a little break inside here at Spruce Saddle, a great place to stop. And, you know, if you want to spend more time on the mountain, get up here, just skip the hassle of I-70 and fly directly right into Eagle Airport because then you get to spend more time on the mountain like me. And it's going to be a beautiful day. You're going to want to be on the mountain starting off today in the single digits right around 9 degrees. But, man, it is warming up so fast. I feel like it's warmer than that already. Reaching that high today of about 35. So lots of sunshine out there for you. It's going to be absolutely beautiful, bright, clear, low wind, great day on the hill. As we move into tonight, we're going to stay in the double digits overnight tonight, that overnight low, only dropping down to around 10 degrees. Now that sun is only setting around 4.55, so we've got those days getting longer for the new year. Now, if you are traveling along the I-70 corridor, you should have pr pretty clear conditions, really warm in Denver, reaching that high of about 58. 41 for Vail, 38 for Avon, and 36 to the west of us over in Eagle. The sunshine is going to stay with us into Sunday. By the time we get to tomorrow night, we do have about a 50% chance of some snow 
coming back into the area. And we're sort of going to have a mix of that through the week. Uh, some so snow, some sunny skies, so a little bit of everything. Hopefully you can enjoy us for the week. But again, some mixed light conditions for the week ahead. So we're going to check in with Eric for that lens of the day. Lens of the Day is brought to you by Eyepieces of Vail and Goggle Bar, serving the Vail Valley for over 30 years. Thanks a lot, Michelle. Well, as we just saw with that five-day forecast, we should be having abundant sunshine today and then transitioning into a little bit of cloud cover for the majority of that next week. And that means you're going to want a goggle that can handle everything so that you can ski and snowboard and see the mountain quite clearly from first chair to last chair. And you can do that uh, with these Anon MW M1 goggles, rather. These are a women's specific Anon frame. Uh, so that means they're sized perfectly for a smaller female face. And the lens changes just as easy as magic. You just squeeze the softer frame and it releases the more rigid lens. And you can just pop a brand new lens in with your mittens on from the chairlift. It's very, very easy to do. Um, these Anon WM1 goggles, uh, if you are somebody that has glasses, have a nice recessed part of the frame here for the arm of the glasses to live inside so it's not going to pinch against your face. So if you've got glasses, uh, it's a very great goggle to put over those. Uh, it's also amazingly fast lens chain system. And you can find not only the Anon WM1, but any of the goggles from the Anon Magnet collection that includes the M2, the M4, which is very unique in that you can have both cylindrical or spherical lenses in that, and their brand new Fusion Sync goggle. Uh, and check out all of the Anon collection at any of the many locations of eyepieces. My favorite one being the top of Bridge Street because they've got a cappuccino bar there. You can also find them uh, in Beaver Creek Village as well as Edwards, uh, and then also across from the Solaris Center in Vail Village. Plenty of eyepieces uh, to go see an amazing collection of goggles. And uh, we got more Good Morning Vail coming up next. We're for the fashion forward and budget minded. We've got the brands that set you apart, the style to make you stand out, the looks that let you shine. We're for the dreamers, the doers, and the savers. Outlets at Silverthorne, elevate your savings. Save up to 70% off on over 50 of the best designer brands as you stroll through our three beautiful shopping villages. Head to Bistro 14 for lunch and relax with breathtaking views of Mount of the Holy Cross. This mountaintop eatery is perfect for the whole family with a kids menu, ski in, ski out access during lunch and also open for dinner by riding the Eagle Bond Gondola. Vail, like nothing on earth. Our world is constantly changing, but the joys of winter are eternal. This fall, celebrate the official kickoff to winter with Warren Miller's 70th anniversary film, Timeless, presented by Volkswagen. Explore British Columbia, Colorado, France, Austria, Switzerland, and more, alongside legendary ski icons like Glenn Flake. It's not just a movie, it's an experience 70 years in the making. Find a show near you at warrenmiller.com. Here at PSI, we've been serving the Valley's plumbing, heating, and drain cleaning needs for over 18 years. We are expert technicians with the knowledge and training to provide prompt and professional maintenance and repair. Our fleet of vehicles are equipped with the most advanced technology and tools available today. PSI is committed to providing the best possible service and guarantee our work. Call us anytime, day or night. PSI is here for you 24-7, 365. We look forward to hearing from you. Welcome back to the base of Centennial here in Beaver Creek. I'm here with the Beaver Creek Resort Club, Sarah in Rarity. Thanks for being here. Absolutely, good to see you. Good to see you too. So we have a ton to talk about. I was just saying to you, it's such a busy weekend up here. It's still the end of a holiday weekend. You have Fun Fest this afternoon. 
so much more. There's a bunch of racers out here getting going. Just an awesome weekend in Beaver Creek. Absolutely. Lots of great energy. Lots of people around this morning. And then tomorrow kicks off our snowshoe race series. So right. the first of three. Great event. Great time to get up with friends, with family. Whether you're trying to race and set a new personal record, which we definitely have people that are here competing. Right. We were just saying Josiah Middow. He's a top racing champ across many different disciplines. So just awesome that he uh, is going to be in that tomorrow. Absolutely. And then we have families that come out with their kids. We have a 5K and a 10K. So really wonderful chance to get out and enjoy the beauty of Beaver Creek. That's awesome. Yeah, so if you're, you know, highly competitive, you want to do the 10K, maybe if you're not, if more family friendly, the 5K. Absolutely. And we see all different levels, all ages. It's really a family friendly event. So whether you're here, like I said, to set a new PR, or just want to get out and get some exercise and start off your Sunday in a great way, it's a wonderful opportunity. And there's a chance to sign up for that even as early as, you know, 8 to 9.30 tomorrow morning next to Beaver Creek Sports. Exactly. So we have registration online. So you can go to beavercreek.com slash snowshoe. We have both the series pass you can get a ticket for all three oh, so wow. the next two are february 2nd and then march 8th so if you're going to be here for all three i recommend the series pass sure if you just want to do one race at a time those are available too sign up for the five or 10k or if you're not sure just want to show up tomorrow morning registration starts at 8 30. nice and the race starts at 10 a.m exactly 10 o'clock it's a beautiful course and we start in creekside park the course maps online so just a great chance to get out and enjoy the beauty of beaver creek and kick off your sunday that's awesome and the conditions tomorrow should be ideal we don't have any uh you know, weather, no snow in the forecast. So again, it's bright and sunny already today. It's probably going to be like that tomorrow. I think it's going to be a beautiful day for a race tomorrow. Awesome. What else should we talk about here in the Beaver Creek Village? So we've got Winter Culinary Weekend coming up. That's right. End of this month. So January 23rd through 26th, we've got 14 events across four days. Oh, sounds so yummy. It's going to be a great chance to meet some wonderful guest chefs. So we have Andrew Zimmern is one of our guest chefs, Tyson Cole, Antonio Lafaso. We have incredible guest chefs this year. We'll showcase some great wineries and and we have some new events this year. So the Art of Sushi and Seafood at Hooked with um, guest chef Tyson Cole. That's going to be on Friday evening. Oh, that's awesome. I was eating some sushi last night, so I just love sushi. <laughs> it's the best. And then we have a new dinner at Splendido that's a culinary collaboration with Katsuji Tanabe oh, wow. and um, Brother Luck. And then obviously their chef, Brian Ackerman. So a lot of great events. Check it out at beavercreek.com slash culinary. And Obviously, the big event of the weekend is Synesthesia at the Villar Performing Arts Center, and St. Paul and the Broken Bones will be the band this year. So. Oh, that's going to be a great show. If you want to get tickets to that, get them early, because that show will sell out. Absolutely, and that's a really nice event, because it starts off with a tasting at the VPAC, so our guest chefs and host chefs, wineries, will do a tasting for two hours, and then a really intimate concert with St. Paul and the Broken Bones, so you get the best of, best of both worlds for that one. That's awesome. That's great. My um, my wife's a chef, and she used to work at Splendido at the Chateau with Brian Ackerman, oh, awesome. so she knows Brian really well, and as a chef, I just love uh, anything she creates, but we're going to have to come up at least for one or two of those events during Absolutely. that week. Such a great event here at Beaver Creek. Yep. So anything else? We should try and get as much of the info out to the people as possible right now. Sure. So some more events we have for Winter Culinary Weekend. We have our guided snowshoe excursion and luncheon. So that's a great event. Our guests get paired up with guides from the Nordic Center, do a beautiful snowshoe hike on the mountain, and then finish up with a lunch at Saddle Ridge, paired with some great wines. Oh, that's awesome. Which is a nice one. We have Ski Eat Ski, which, again, people get paired up with in Instructors, they go on some pretty pretty tough terrain on the mountain and then have a lunch at Zach's cabin. So it's a really nice weekend because it's a blend of on mountain adventures. You know, we have the dinner at Ali's cabin on Friday night with Chef Antonio Lafaso. So you could do some really fun on mountain snow adventures or you know stay in the village, do some great wine paired dinners as well. Oh, that's great. Well, we're gonna wrap up here, Sarah. Thanks for being here Absolutely. and just coming up, we have a little bit more. Good morning, Vale. This weather report is brought to you by Supercoop, the official sunscreen of Vail Resorts. There's going to be so much sunshine out there on the hill today. Make sure you're putting on a little bit of Supercoop before you head out there. You definitely want to get that SPF of 35 or above, I would say, on a day like today. But beautiful, beautiful conditions. Starting off right now around 9, 10 degrees outside. But already it is so bright. It's great. Now we are going to be warming up about 25 degrees from where we're at right now throughout the course of the day today. Reaching that high of about 35 by this afternoon. There's no wind or anything whenever I was outside. It's really nice, really clear, really beautiful. As we go into this evening, temperatures are going to cool back down. That overnight low of around 10 degrees, that sun now setting at 455. So you've got a little bit more time to enjoy yourself outside at any one of our Colorado resorts. Mid-mountain temperatures at Vail, we're looking at 34, 33 for Beaver Creek and Breckenridge, and 37 for over in Keystone. 
Now these sunny skies are going to stay with us all day today into the start of tomorrow. But once we get into the middle of the week, we're sort of going to have a mix of some sun, some clouds are going to be coming through and hopefully a little bit more snow. But if you are headed out there onto the mountain today, make sure you get yourself geared up with a little bit of super goop to start your day because it is going to be definitely a goop kind of day. Coming up next, we have a little bit more Good Morning Bell, including that watch and win. Ready to hit the slopes? Buying or renting the right gear can make or break your trip. Luckily, Outdoor Divas, the nation's first women-specific ski shop, is your expert in women's ski equipment. Our specialized staff has been making women and vacations happy since 2002 with comfortable fit solutions for every shape and size. Swing by our friendly ski boutique and let us outfit your vacation with the best gear, geared just for you. Let us put you in the spirits. Hey guys, I'm looking for some amazing craft beer. We got it! Hi, I'm looking for the best wine selection in the Vale Valley. That's us! I'm looking for great customer service and an awesome rewards program. They got it! So if you want great customer service and amazing shopping experience, and we'll even hop in the truck and deliver your goods, then stick with the locals' favorite. Come on down to Avon Liquor. And let us put you in the spirits! Generation GMC Sierra. If you love Vail, you'll love the Aravel Club in Lion's Head. Drive in, ski out, make the most of your time in Vail. At the club, our valets park your car and your skis are waiting for you slopeside. Gear up in the members' lounge with your own private locker. And after a hearty continental breakfast, you'll be on the mountain in record time. It just doesn't get any easier or more fun. So make the most of the mountain with membership at the Arabel Club. It makes all the difference. Huge weekend prize today for our Saturday watch and win. It's this incredible Thule 90 liter snow sport duffel. This is essentially the ultimate duffel for bringing all of your gear to the mountain. Now let me show off some of these incredible features. My favorite one, uh, this big zippered open top lays itself down and actually has a waterproof coating on it so you can stand on this in the parking lot, in the parking structure and not have to get your feet wet while you're changed from your shoes into your ski boots. It's got two side pockets which are also waterproof separate from the main compartment. They've got um, some little um, we're going to call them water drains in the bottom of them. So if you put a wet boot into these pockets, it's going to drain the water out. It's got this amazing little felt pocket inside the bag for your goggles or your sunglasses and plenty of space for your jacket, for your helmet, for your gloves, for whatever you need on the inside of this 90 liter bag. And some uh, a great feature that it has, it's uh, part of the Thule family, so it easily uh, attaches itself to their Thule Snow Sport ski or snowboard carrier. So if you're going through the airport, it's very easy 
to uh, have all of your gear in this bag through the airport. And thanks to Outside Television for sponsoring this watch and win. This isn't just a first caller watch and win. I got a question for you. I want to know how much snow did Vail receive over the past five days? We've put it up on the screen a few times throughout the show. Uh, there are two numbers inside of this digit. It might also be the inch equivalent of a foot. I don't know. Give us a call right now. How much snow did Vail get over the past five days? And stick around. We got more Good Morning Vail coming up next. This resort report is brought to you by Good Morning Vale. Follow us on Facebook for live interviews and mountain reports. Welcome back to Beaver Creek. We are talking everything this amazing resort that we have here. So if you can see just behind me a little bit, that is the Hay Meadow Park area. That is just an awesome beginner to an intermediate area, mostly for ski school, adult and child ski school. It has a great uh, short gondola ride right up the hill here, and that's Hay Meadow Park for all of your beginner and ski school needs. And you can just check in right to the building just next to that and get your uh, kids all checked in or your adult ski school and then move on to the Hay Meadow Park gondola and get going on the mountain and learn a lot about the fundamentals of skiing and snowboarding. Then what we're, we're talking about Red Buffalo Park too, which was recently cr um, completed a couple years ago. Red Buffalo Park is awesome and it takes you all the way to the top at an elevation uh, just slightly over 11,000 and just under 11,500 feet. Red Buffalo Park has an awesome adventure zone, a kid zone and a family friendly zone. Um, while also having just a ski school specifics zone. So you hop right into Red Buffalo Park just past ski, ski patrol headquarters and access tons of amazing terrain, intermediate and beginner level terrain. And McCoy Park is another beautiful area just near the top of Strawberry Park. And you can also access it from the upper Beaver Creek chairlift that uh, is between uh, Beaver Creek and Bachelor Gulch. And the McCoy Park area is a great snowshoe area that um, is now going to have some new facelift and capital renovations for a change in the 2020 and 2021 season. That's going to be bringing two brand new chairlifts, one which is a four-man high-speed chairlift, and it's going to access a new zone that's going to be an intermediate and beginner level zone up at the top of McCoy Peak. And that's, uh, or I'm sorry, McCoy Park. That is also going to still keep a awesome snowshoe area for anyone that has already loved and enjoyed the McCoy Park snowshoe area. So we are really looking forward to two new chairlifts and what that new access will bring us. I can't wait. Anytime they bring a new high speed chairlift, it's only going to be about a four, four and a half minute ride on that lift, and you're going to be back to the top of McCoy Park and having more fun on your skis or boards. And uh, we have. Just a ton more coming up for Good Morning Vale in just a little bit. And I'm looking forward to uh, just being able to check out Michelle's first tracks in a little in a little while. I'm Mary and this is Dave Melsa. We are mountain hosts here at Beaver Creek. We've been working here for 10 years. And every morning when we get up and come out on the mountain, it's like a new experience, a new date for the two of us. It's cookie time! Every day at 3 o'clock, the doors open and out come the cookies on the tray. Oh, yeah! Cookies! Cookie time! Time is cookie time. The word has it that Beaver Creek provides over 700,000 cookies a year to all the guests. I always forget the number. Cookie time! He's after snowshoeing. <laughs> they might not remember the name of the slope that they really like to ski on, but they remember the chocolate chip cookies. This weather report is brought to you by Sun and Ski Sports, your new mountain sports headquarters.
For over 60 years, Warren Miller has captured the spirit of the mountains and the culture of snow sports. Tune into TV8 Daily at 3 p.m. and 7.30 p.m. for timeless Warren Miller films presented by Sun & Ski Sports, your new mountain sports headquarters. Get ready for a thoroughly captivating experience. Live, on stage, an American in Paris. Wonderful. Based on the 1951 MGM classic with a score that is pure Gershwin, a story that is pure romance, it's an extravaganza of song and dance. Don't miss An American in Paris. See you around, little man. Yeah, you'll see me. Here at PSI, we've been serving the Valley's plumbing, heating, and drain cleaning needs for over 18 years. We are expert technicians with the knowledge and training to provide prompt and professional maintenance and repair. Our fleet of vehicles are equipped with the most advanced technology and tools available today. PSI is committed to providing the best possible service and guarantee our work. Call us anytime, day or night, PSI is here for you 24-7, 365. We look forward to hearing from you. Well, if you've been coming off of Vail Mountain at the end of the day and heard the distinct sound of European bells ringing, you might be wondering, why are those bells ringing? Well, it's a new initiative, a little partnership with the town of Vail and Vail Mountain uh, to better enhance the guest experience by bringing more of a European apre feel to Vail Village and Lion's Head. If you've ever skied or snowboard in Europe, you know how much Europeans love their apre ski festivities. So at 3 p.m., you'll begin to hear the bells ring, and this is your sign that it is time to apre around Vail. And there, almost every bar and restaurant across Vail and Lion's Head is participating in this. Some of the highlights, vendettas in Vail Village, amazing pizza. This is also where ski patrollers hang out. Peppies in Vail Village for that unique Austrian flair. The Remedy Bar at Four Seasons uh, for their panoramic windows and fire pits. And then finally, El Sabor in Lion's Head, right, right at Slopeside, amazing patio and amazing food. But don't just take my word for it. Let's watch a little video about El Sabor. Once you get your fill on the hill, located just steps from the skier bridge here at the base in Lion's Head, you're going to find El Sabor Restaurant. El Sabor Restaurant is one of only a few restaurants here in the Vail area that offers truly ski-in and ski-out dining. They have grab-and-go burritos every morning for breakfast, unforgettable and affordable lunches, and an outstanding dinner menu. Let's head into the kitchen now and find out what the staff is serving up. Let's go. Mikey D, thanks for letting us come into the kitchen today at El Sabor. You're welcome. Yeah. Glad to have you. Um, so your menu is pretty unique, and you have some new offerings that you're incorporating. What are you going to make up today? Today we're going to make our daily special, which is going to be catfish tacos. Catfish tacos. What Delicious. a good idea. Sounds delish. Do you want to walk us through the process? Sure can. Okay. Sounds good. All right, here we go. So we start with some catfish fillets. Okay. We soak them in buttermilk. Then we have our flour mix, flour, salt, pepper, paprika, a little cayenne. Okay. Right? So once they've marinated, we're gonna put them in the flour and just coat them nice. Once you have them coated, they go right to the fryer. Okay. Put our basket in. Yeah. Take our fish. And you wanna get it one 1,000, two 1,000. This way it doesn't stick to the bottom. Oh, got you. Now, these are thin fillets. They probably cook pretty fast, don't they? They do. They'll be done in about a minute and a half to two minutes. Okay. Right to the texture we want for tacos. And once they're done, we're gonna hang them out, let them dry off for a minute. Now we're ready for tacos. Okay, Mike, minute and a half for the catfish in the fryer until they float. That's correct. Let them dry off, and now the final preparation in the plating. We have some tortillas here that we kind of cooked, so they got a little bit of a bubble in them. It gives them a little crunch, but yet keeps them soft. Okay. We prefer to use corn tortillas. Then we're gonna take habanero slaw and put that on the bottom. Take our pieces of fish, lay them in there nice and pretty. We're gonna put some Roja aioli on there. What's the flavor behind the Roja aioli? So the Roja is one of our sauces that we use for enchiladas. It's made from a guajillo chili. Then we're gonna add some cotilla cheese. 
just a little bit. It's pretty pungent, so you only want to use a little. Okay. And finish with cilantro for color and flavor, freshness. And that, catfish taco. No, oh, that looks so good. I got to taste that right now. All right, let's go eat them up. Sounds good. Beautiful out here on the back patio, Mike. We're overlooking the skier bridge right next to Gore Creek. And uh, the food looks great and smells even better. So these are the catfish tacos. What else did you bring out? Well, we have a great burger menu. We do sandwiches every week from different regions of the country. And we do daily specials, just like the catfish tacos. And we also feature handcrafted cocktails. So Mike, these are made from scratch every day? Every day. So good. If people want to find out more about El Sabor, make a reservation, check it out, what would you recommend? Visit the website, elsaborvale.com. Okay. Friend us on Facebook or follow us on Instagram. I love it. Thanks for having us here today, bud. My pleasure, Mark. I love it. All right, once again, this is El Sabor in Lion's Head, and this is The Local Dish. Lion's Head Jewelers, a mainstay of Lion's Head Village for more than a decade, our 4,000 square foot gallery is home to the largest selection of one-of-a-kind designer jewelry in the Vale Valley. Come see our breathtaking array of museum quality fossils, meteorites, and collectible minerals. Explore Lion's Head Jewelers. Spend an afternoon with us. You'll come in as a customer and leave as a friend. Join us at Vail Public Library and engage your senses weekly with gentle yoga, group meditation, or Zumba as part of our Healthy Lifestyle series. Check out the Tech Studio, our very own makerspace. Explore, create, collaborate, and invent in a safe and supportive environment. Connect with a variety of performers, musicians, authors, historians as part of our evenings of engagement. We also offer summer reading programs for all ages. We offer a variety of activities for the younger set, including reading buddies, a one-on-one -on -one reading experience, robotics club, and our Kids Create programs. Vail Public Library is your public library. There's something for everyone, and we hope you'll visit us very soon. This Weather and Mountain Report is brought to you by GMC, the exclusive partner of Vail Resorts. Welcome back. We're here in the heart of the Beaver Creek Village, right by the ticket office. It's getting busy and the crowds are starting to get rolling for the day. And again, let's give you some quick weather updates. So we're going to be about nine degrees here, single digits, and it's going to climb quickly as the sun is still just rising over the peaks here in Beaver Creek. So high of 35 today. And uh, tonight it's going to be a sunset right before 5 p.m., 4.55, and a low of 10 degrees. So mostly clear all throughout the day, mostly sunny all throughout the day, and tonight a mostly clear sunset. So you might get that amazing red alpine glow as the sun just dips down before 5 p.m. And at all of our resorts today, it's looking mostly sunny and beautiful, again, throughout the Vale and Beaver Creek area. Temps are in the low 30s at both Beaver Creek and Vale, and the mid 30s, low 30s as well over at Breck and Keystone. There are some wind gusts in Summit County, so you will find at Breck and Keystone some uh, wind gusts throughout the day, and that is fairly common for the Breck and Keystone area. All across these resorts, we've had 8 to 10 inches. Um, slightly climbing above 10 inches uh, in the last five days. So great snow, great powder all the last five days, and now some great grooming all across all of our resorts. Our five-day forecast is also looking great for tomorrow, mostly sunny, uh, mid th to low 30s all throughout the day. And then temps will drop on Monday to a high of only 17. And then we'll rise on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday up into the high 20s and low 30s with a chance of some evening snow on Wednesday. We have Michelle coming up in just a minute on uh, some more first chair and giving us some more capital improvements of Vail information. First chair is brought to you by Christie Sports Ski and Snowboard Shops. We'll see you out there. 
look at that beautiful corduroy as far as the eye can see. I'm here in Beaver Creek. I'm on gold dust right now. That's what you're looking at. It's absolutely perfect. Soft, nicely groomed, nice light, no wind. It is a beautiful day here on the hill. Hopefully you can get out and join me. Maybe you're getting ready to head back home. Stop by Christie Sports. They have everything you could possibly need for your time here on the mountain. Or, you know, it's even nicer to take that little present back home for yourself. They have everything in there from knickknacks to the gear that you got to get. But you know what? Why don't you just come for a Good Morning Vale is brought to you in part by Helly Hansen, outfitters of Vale Resorts professionals. Visit them in Lion's Head to get outfitted for your day on the mountain. When the mountain tests you, trust is all you have. And trust will set you free. Nest Furnishings and Consignment, located in the heart of the Vale Valley. Nest offers a variety of beautiful, affordably priced home furnishings, art, and accessories for your mountain home. Henredon Restoration Hardware, Ralph Lauren, just to name a few brands available at Nest. Decorate your mountain home at Nest Furnishings and Consignment. Consignment redefined. You can always count on Vail Resorts to expand and improve their operations and this year no different from the others. Exciting announcement from this past summer, Vail Resorts acquired Peak Resorts which was the owner operator of 17 resorts across the country. These include resorts like Mount Snow in Vermont, Attitash Mountain in New Hampshire, Hunter Mountain in New York, uh, mountains all across the Midwest and eastern part of the United States. So all of those guests that used to just singularly ride at Peak Resorts are now part of the Vail Resorts family. Uh, and they're going to be improving these resorts by adding updated chairlifts, updated food and beverage services, updated uh, base mountain operations. You will start to see many of these uh, upgrades take effect beginning next season. And one of my favorite parts about uh, being an Epic Pass holder is utilizing the Epic Mix app. This is the app that tells you how long you have to wait in line. Uh, this is the app that tells you how many vertical feet you've been riding, gives you all those pins for you to have fun little friendly competitions with your friends and family. And Vail Resorts will be improving and upgrading the Epic Mix app, adding interactive maps, even more transparent lift lines, and just more overall usability and information on the various mountains now that we have 17 new family members as part of the Vail Resorts family. So many mountains across the Epic Pass. I did the math this past summer. I think it's around 4% of the resorts in the across uh, North America are now available on one pass. Just incredible stuff. We're getting some updates here locally, and to tell us more about that, here's Chris Armistead. Thanks, Eric. Yes, we are talking a lot more about some of the capital improvements that will be taking place in Summit County. At Breckenridge, they're gonna be adding a new high-speed chairlift at peak seven. And over at Keystone Mountain, they're going to be actually replacing a four-man uh, high-speed lift. That's the Peru lift and replacing it with a six-man high-speed chairlift. So that's at the base of Keystone Mountain. That's going to improve capacity and improve all-around uh, flow of traffic all from the base of Keystone for that six-man. That is pending some capital improvement approvals. So we'll wait to hear a little bit more about that and make sure uh, to announce that when it becomes an official capital improvement. Just amazing when you can think about adding uh, anything high speed and going from four man to six man. It just
just gets more people moving quicker, more people up to more runs throughout the day, just makes everyone more happy on the mountain, and that's kind of what it's all about out here. We are loving the conditions out here. The sun is about to peak over the mountains in Beaver Creek. It's blue skies and just an ideal day to be out here and going fast and skiing and snowboarding. And we have uh, just a little bit more from Michelle on first chair. She's going to give us a lot more about what you want to tune in for tomorrow. So Michelle, what do you have for us? We're for the fashion forward and budget minded. We've got the brands that set you apart, the style to make you stand out, the looks that let you shine. We're for the dreamers, the doers, and the savers. Outlets at Silverthorne, elevate your savings. Save up to 70% off on over 50 of the best designer brands as you stroll through our three beautiful shopping villages. Welcome to Boone's Wine and Spirits. We have the lowest prices and the best selection. Five in-house sommeliers offer expert advice for every occasion. We have 42 cooler doors and free ice with every $20 purchase. Boone's Wine and Spirits. Your, your destination for fine wine, spirits, and cold beer. First Chair is brought to you by Christie Sports Ski and Snowboard Shops. We'll see you out there. Everything on the hill today is beautiful. I'm a little bit further down. Uh, gold dust here and the grooming is just so nice and soft. We're going to be warming up with those sunny skies today so the light conditions are absolutely spectacular. Now, Maybe you didn't get what you wanted for Christmas. Maybe your New Year's resolution was to get out there and get yourself in a little bit better shape. Well, a great way to do that is just get out and get on the hill. And you know, the people at Christie Sports, if you're not comfy in your boots, if you need some new gear, maybe you just want to rent some gear and try some different things out, go check out Christie Sports. They have everything you need to bring home with you from vacation if you're just looking for those little knickknacks or souvenirs to the gear that you didn't get under your tree. So go check them out. Now, coming up tomorrow, we have another great show for you here. We're gonna be doing some shopping over in Lion's Head. We'll be back out on the hill showing you everything firsthand. And it should be another beautiful bluebird kind of day. But what do you say we just take a ride down the hill together and enjoy all of this spectacular grooming we have here at Beaver Creek. <laughs> 